why it's time black people fell in love with Insuni from South Korea. Hello everybody, welcome back to the home. It's your favorite black culture geek, Renan Esteem. And today, I will introduce you to one of the most soulful singers in the world. And one of the best to ever come out of South Korea. And her name is Kim Insoon. Better known as Insuni, and this melanated sister can sing. She is the daughter of a black military man and a lovely South Korean mother. And growing up, she virtually had no contact with him because he was living in the United States and her mother had stopped writing him. And you can only imagine what life was like for this young lady because she definitely looked different from other people, especially since I think she favors her father. It is also well documented that she had problems at school because kids would constantly taunt her for being black. And that is something I can relate to because I was told I was too black when I came into the United States. And that was coming from my own people. The bullying got so bad that once she graduated middle school, she decided not to continue her education. And the only way she found to cope was to sing. And sing this young lady did. Because just one listen to her and your move. I mean, it's like someone is lifting your soul right out of your body. And that's to be expected when you have the DNA of kings and queens. And Suni is a beast vocally. But it took some time for people to realize it. In the beginning of her career, she was part of a girl group. And even though people had doubts about them being a success, her raw vocal talent proved them wrong. The name of the group was the He Sisters, and after she departed, she would become the most famous person to come from that group. And she has had an illustrious career, recording 19 albums, and she's known as an R&B diva. There is not an award that this woman has not won. She is certified on every level. And people who hear her immediately fall in love with her voice. I remember the first thing that impressed me was her range. It was like she started from her belly and kept getting more and more powerful. It was utterly beautiful and moving at the same time. And everyone who knows me knows how much I love music. So I don't just throw that compliment around. Also, after she achieved massive success, she went on a hunt for her father. Because it was a connection that she still wanted to have. And after pulling some strings, she found out that her father was living in Delaware. And in true superstar fashion, she flew over. The most beautiful part is the fact that it's documented. So I'll have a link in the description showing the video and her music. To me, it was touching and a joy to see them reunite. You can feel the love that they had for each other. And that is an example of life having no distance. You could be on the other side of the galaxy and you'll still be connected. And Suni also went on to have a family of her own. She has one daughter that became an honor student. And the icing on the cake is the fact that she went on to graduate from Stanford University. So she finished what her mother did not. And that is a gift that keeps her on giving. And Suni's story showed that black excellence cannot be doubted. People kept trying to put her in a box and she kept breaking out. And that is the approach that all black folks should have mentally. You should strive for greatness. There should be nothing ordinary about you. And if they won't give you heaven, give them hell. And another thing I love about her story is that it proves that love conquers all. Because if you watch any of her performance in Korea, people are moved and they're crying during her shows. They can feel her pain and sorrow. And in feeling that, they feel connected to her. So she is now one of the most beloved artists. And I'm pretty sure that the people who picked on her as a kid feel truly horrible. And it shows that no matter how deep you fall into the darkness, you can always find the light. Now after you smash the like button for this video, make sure you click the link in the description to check her out. And if you enjoy hanging out at the house, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you never miss a video. And when you're done doing that, click on one of my videos that just popped up. And I'll see you on the next one.